you know, lawmakers right now, they are working on something to try to protect kids. News Channel 5's Cole Johnson joins us live with more. So, Cole, tell us about this bill, about how they're trying to hope to spot human trafficking in the classroom. Good morning, Aaron. Well, this bill, if you work for a school district, it will impact you if it does become law. It would require anyone that works for a school to get trained in spotting those signs of human trafficking, and it would have to be for in kids for every three years. And we want to take a look at human trafficking in Tennessee really as a whole to see how big of an issue this is really. And the latest data from the National Human Trafficking Hotline says in 2020, there were 165 cases reported. The bigger picture, though, from 2007 to 2020, more than 1300 trafficking victims were found in Tennessee. And right now, Tennessee code requires teachers to have an in service training once every three years on human trafficking. They watch a video approved by local education agencies. It's assumed they already have what's necessary for these trainings. It'll just be a matter of increasing the amount of employees going through it. Since this is something the districts already do, the bill sponsor says there would be no significant fiscal impact to implement these rules. Again, this would really affect anyone that works for a school district and the bill is being heard by the Senate Education Committee today, and that is happening at 3 o'clock. Reporting live in the state capitol, Cole Johnson, News Channel 5.